Hello Virgo! Thank you very much for tuning in to this week's read. For the main part of the read, I'm using Gilded Tarot Royale by Chiro Marchetti, text by Barbara Moore. Um, website at the bottom, Llewellyn.com. There's a couple other social media links. Feel free to check out anything you might be interested if you are. Supportive Oracle Cards. Uh, no. Wisdom of the Hidden <laughs> Realms Oracle Cards by Colette Baron reed On the back here are a few websites. Feel free to freeze frame and check those out if you want to. There's also the Colette Baron reed website. It's at the end of the paragraph next to her picture. Um, there's a couple other things there. Feel free to freeze frame if you want any of that. And last but not least, about the illustrator Jenna. That, hopefully that focuses. If you want to read any of that information, just feel free to freeze frame and check out whatever you want to check out. Huh? Okay, what do we have for Virgo? Um, I think you already know something's about to happen. Okay, that's interesting. Um, have you been blocking something? Have you been blocking something? Let's go a little farther. So, I kind of feel like you've been blocking something. You've been blocking something, which is not a bad thing. If you feel like that's what you needed to do, you did what you had to do. Um, a lot of communication in this one, too. Seven of Wands is kind of like holding it back. The 17 is the, that's Major Arcana, uh, it's the star. And you got this card just kind of flopping out here, kind of like saying something has been blocked. I feel like you've been very careful with communication. You didn't want something coming forward. You've been very good with the control when it comes to communication. Very good with that. I, I don't think this is bad at all. But you might have been blocking people for a very good reason. I don't, I, I'd be surprised if you didn't have a reason for it. Uh, I don't. I don't really feel like I was just not. I was just blocking something to block it. I feel like there's a good reason. Clearly, some people would just block it just for fun, and I don't feel that for this one. Uh, and not that Virgo would do that anyway. But whatever it is, something. I feel like it's been. It's kind of been simmering there for a while, and you you clearly knew what was going on, but you've been keeping it to yourself, f for the most part. Um. What is this? Can we, like... Because I feel like you're letting information loose fairly soon. More more because, you know, it's going to come forward anyway, and it's kind of like it's better if I start moving it forward very slowly. It feels like it'll be more comfortable for me, like Virgo energy, more comfortable for you. Um, you I feel like I, I don't... It's not that I want to do that. It's kind of like... The way things are going, it's coming forward one way or another. So, I feel like if I let the information out, I can more deal with it on my terms, rather than if it just starts coming out on its own. And if that's how it is, that's how it is. But still, I feel like, eh, maybe I'll let it go. Um, you got this Ace of Swords here. That's the Ace of Communication. Thought, sometimes. I'm getting communication in this one. Um, you're releasing it slowly. You got the hanged man half in, half out. You got the ten of cups on its side. Same thing, half in, half out. Um, this is you're releasing it to people. Could be family. Could be flat out just family. Could be family and friends. These are to people that actually matter and that have been in your life for a while. Um, You're going to get a lot of support going forward with this, and I don't feel like that's the problem. There's a lot of support for you here, but it's kind of like... Whatever it is that's been changing, it's been going on for a while. Is this... Okay, how do you feel about this change? Like, there's something up with this. Like, there's something going on here. Um, it's happening. It may have already happened, in a sense. 
it's just if to you it feels like it's already happened. You've probably already made peace with this change. You're gonna get a lot of support for it. Um, there's a lot coming to you. Your energy seems to feel a little awkward about it, though. Um, it's a change. There's a lot of support. I get that there's a lot of support. Okay, can we get one more roll? Because I'm like, it feels awkward. Like, things are like non-action for you. Like, it's like it already ha it's like it already happened for you. Seven of Wands is still holding ground. Whatever the change is, I, it's not like, I feel like, again, like it's not like I wanted it to happen, but it has to happen. Something like that. Um, it's it, awkward energy. You've got good cards, but the energy feels... Well, there's one card there, but... Um, whatever's coming forward, things are happening, changes are happening. You seem to... To you, it feels like it already happened. When it's coming forward, you're in a more stable place with it than when it started, if that makes sense. Um, it's kind of like, it's not about liking it, it's about just moving forward with what I need to do. Not understanding what's coming next. Maybe this is it too, because I'm seeing the Seven of Cups for you. That's not really a very friendly card for a Virgo. You like a plan, you like to know what's happening, you like to, you know, move forward, move forward accordingly. And there's a lot of open spaces here that I just don't know what's going to fill into these spaces. And maybe that's part of this. Um, there's some unknowns coming forward for you. Even though things are going to work out, even though there's a lot of support, there's a lot of support for you going forward. And I get things keep getting better gradually, but I'm also getting this is mirroring in with it. Matching in with it is probably what I should say. As things fill in, as the sport comes in, as things get better, it's just kind of like a day-by-day -day situation. It's It doesn't really have a plan. It doesn't really like link up that way. It's just kind of like, well, this is what's happening today, and I got the support to get me through it. And then the next day comes and like, all right, here's some some new stuff and here's some what I'm going to deal with it today. Um, you do seem to be doing well, but I, there's not a plan. I feel like that's what's bothering me. I think that's why it's awkward. I don't have a plan, but I'm going through it and I'm getting through it. I don't have a plan. It's like I don't ha I feel like I don't have a plan. Um, not, that, not, not because you don't want one. But because I just, it's just like you can plan, but it's just like that plan, it doesn't go, any, like, it's a plan, but like, things change and I can't use that plan. And then I try to plan again, things change, I can't use that plan or that other plan. And just, it's, you're not about wasting your time, and it's like, if I, why plan if I can't use the plans? Like, they they become useless. You got the lover's card with the desert prince. It's ironic that things are going to go really well for you. Um, the way it comes forward, I'm getting these, these two cards together. I do get that there's really good things happening here. But as they're happening, I'm not feeling comfortable with it. Because I don't feel like there's a stability. I don't feel like I don't feel rooted. I feel like, yeah, things are good and everything looks nice and everything's fine. Every day things go better. But it's like, I don't have my plan, and I want it. Um, I want it. I really want my plan. <laughs> I want my plan. I keep feeling that energy, like, I want my plan. Um, like, what can I say about that? Even though it's good, it doesn't feel it, because it's like, I'm missing the stability. It's really a problem. Um, it's hard for you to believe in it. I feel like until I can have until I have some type of structure below me, I just don't feel like I can believe in it, or it's just like it's, I'm not comfortable. Whatever this situation is, it's going to take at least three or four months before you start feeling like your feet are on the ground. Even though things go well, it's going to be three or four months before you really start to feel comfortable with that, and then it's going to be baby steps as you're able to like put things where they need to go and feel more stable with them. I feel like this reading is about that. Like, because I feel like there's going to be a lot of support around you and people like, you know, it's good, isn't it? Isn't th aren't, aren't you feeling great now? Aren't you happy now? And it's kind of like, 
because that stability isn't there, it doesn't feel like that stability is there, it's hard to feel that way. And that there's nothing wrong with that. Um, it's going to take some time. Three to four months before it starts feeling right, and that's just starting. A year from now, I feel like you'll look back and it'll be like, all right, <laughs> I got through that. And I feel like I keep looking back even a year from now, and I'm like, it wasn't bad, but it didn't feel as good as it was. It just didn't, and this, and I'm getting, if you're missing that piece, like, why, why doesn't it feel right? That's why it doesn't feel right. Um, it's just, like, other people, I feel like, are not going to be able to relate to you during this time. Uh, unless they have more of, like, that, like, understanding that the stability doesn't, it's not there. But you might be keeping that to yourself, too. You might not be sharing, like, why you don't feel stable in the situation. You might be keeping that very private. So other people, that may be another reason people are having a hard time relating to you or you're, they're being like, hey, isn't everything great? And you're like, yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> the, the, this moment will pass, but I feel like this this is kind of like a support thing, kind of like saying there's nothing wrong, but it's very valid the way you feel. Sometimes you can get, a, you can get connected with online forums that are more anonymous and maybe you could kind of find a way to talk these things out and express what you want to express without people in your everyday life knowing where you can kind of work these things out and hash these things out with other people you might be able to do that that might be something that would help um i feel like this reading is just trying trying to help like validate you, you feel the way you feel for a reason it's going to be fine it's going to go well but until you have stability below you again you're not going to feel comfortable with it that's just how this is just how this part's going to roll. I don't know. I hope that's okay. I mean, <laughs> I, I kind of feel bad about it. I, I want it to like go better because I'm getting like, over the next year, you're going to get stronger and stronger. It's going to be three to four months. Things are going to start putting in, you know, they're going to start building. A year from now, you're going to have, you're going to feel like the stability is below you and you're going to feel a lot better. But the reason it's going to make a difference is because it's going to be tangibly there where you could physically hold on to it. So... I almost feel like it's going to take some time. Again, you don't like this. This is not a card that Virgo really cares for. I don't like the open spaces. I don't like the, on, on the you know, I don't I don't like the missing of the base. I need the base material. I need to know what I'm standing on. This is going to feel like I'm standing in murky water. I'm standing on something where I can keep my, you know, my shoulders are above, above the top, like it's above, you know, above water. But, um, I can't see what's below me. I don't know if I can step here, step there. I don't know what else is below here. <laughs> I don't know what's in the water. And then a year from now, you find out that there was nothing in there. And like you could have like walked right out of that or like this. You had a lot of possibilities. You're like, but I couldn't see it at the time. So hopefully this is helpful. Hopefully this is helpful in some respect. I know I'll see it in the comments if it's not. So thank you very much for watching. I'm going to leave it there. Uh, if you need a direct reading from me, shoot me an email, jamesforastral at gmail.com. That's james, the number four, astral at gmail.com. If you're interested in the donation information, that's below. Same email. Thank you very much for watching, and have a great day.